students, today we are going to talk about choosing the right materials for appliances. The importance of the topic. We talked earlier about conductors and insulators. As you remember, a conductor allows electric current to pass and uh, an insulator do not allow electric current to pass. You can give examples that are related with a conductor. An example of a conductor is copper and an example of insulator is uh, plastic. So uh, examples of conductors generally are the metals that they allow the electric current to pass. What is the voltage of the main electricity? And how about the voltage of the two batteries that are given below? The voltage that we use at our homes, uh, you can uh, know this one from your parents, that is 220 volt. And the voltage that is produced by the two batteries that are given, if you take a look at the pictures, you can see that the first battery has a voltage of 1.5 volt and the second one has a voltage of 9 volt. So there is a difference between the voltage that we use uh, in the main electricity and the voltage that is produced by the two batteries. So the voltage that comes uh, from the main electricity is dangerous because it has a value of 220 volt compared with uh, 1.5 volt, for example, the voltage produced by a battery. We have two figures. It's given the figure of the appliance plug and the figure of the plastic covered wire. Related with these figures, I have questions. The first question is why the pins are made of metal and the covering is made of plastic? And the second is why the copper wire is used and why is covered with plastic? You are going to write your answers in the notebook and send me by email. Using mains electricity safety. We said that the main electricity that comes into our homes, it has a voltage of 220 volt. So is very dangerous. This voltage that we use, the electricity that comes into our house, is dangerous and we should be careful when we use the electricity. Why you should uh, be careful? Because you can get an electric shock that uh, can be fatal for you and for us. As a homework, you have also to create your own poster to use the main electricity safety, that is the question 3 in your student's book, and uh, the exercise 5.4 in the activity book. Bye!